hi guys welcome back to a little vlog i always start my vlog so spontaneously i feel like i'm just like going out my day and then i'm like you know what i feel like i'm gonna vlog so i thought i would vlog today um it is tuesday i thought i would just i don't know what, like I, as i always say in every vlog i don't know whether this is gonna be a daily vlog i don't know what's gonna be a weekly vlog it'll probably end up being a weekly vlog and just random snippets of my week but it's tuesday i should have vlogged yesterday because the girls and i went on a little sunrise walk it was very wholesome but um yeah it's tuesday it is 10 30 a.m i woke up feeling a bit just like oof, like a bit like dead um and i have a cycle class tonight so i might cancel that which sucks because i'm going with the girls but i just feel so dead and like with my autoimmune like i just don't want to push myself so on the way to get my hair cut right now my appointment is at 11 um and i'm just gonna chop all the dead ends off i feel like my hair is just so like just dead at the end like they're all just split ends so i want to cut about that much off so it's a good like solid amount but i feel like honestly that is just all dead anyway it doesn't look that bad right now because it's freshly washed i washed it yesterday but when like it's not washed and looking pretty like that's just all frayed and dead and split so i'm at the worst intersection right now i don't know why i come this way every time i come this way i sit here for half an hour because you just can't get out now i can finally get out so yeah i thought i would just vlog because i was like i don't have a video to upload this sunday i'm not really doing anything else this crazy this week that i know i'm gonna vlog for so i was like i might as well vlog there might be a little mini mukbang in there so we're just gonna see where it takes us as always but yeah on the way to get my hair cut i'm really keen to just chop some of it off i never get my hair cut because i really want long hair like you're not gonna get that if you don't cut it like i have a fear of like cutting it because i'm like i want long hair and i'm like it won't grow unless you cut it like I don't know why I've only just realized that at the ripe age of 20. So I'm just going to see what the post office actually on the way because I have packages there and a brand DM'd me because I bought something off them and they were like, hey girl, we just got an email saying that your package is about to be returned because you haven't picked it up. So I need to go in and pick that up. Hey, I'm here. I'm feeling good. Um, I'm just trying to figure out like what I even want to say to them. Like, I don't know. I'm scared. Okay less thinking more doing so okay hair is cut i feel a million i feel a million bucks how cute is that just the tiniest little trim and i love the straight ends like i feel like it's just giving thickness wellness health <laughs> but i love it I really love it. She killed it, as always. I love Akali. She's the best. How good. It just looks so much... It looks so much thicker. Like, so much thicker. Okay, let's go into the office. Have some lunch, do some work. I love it. You like it? I love it. It looks so nice. It just looks so healthy. Oh my god. I almost did. <gasps> yep. Okay, don't kill me. I may or may not have forgotten that I was supposed to be vlogging. And it is now two o'clock. I feel like I always do this. So this will definitely now be a weekly vlog. But I just went and got my hair cut as you saw and then after that I went to the office. But I was just working so much that I just forgot that I was supposed to be vlogging. Like I always forget. But we just did so much work for the next drop which hopefully is dropping really soon but like we are just so like behind or at least like we feel behind i don't know i don't feel like there's really much i can say which is annoying but i wish i could just let you guys in on everything because i feel like it's a lot harder than we make out like we just all of a sudden come out with these drops and it's like there is so much shit that actually happens behind the scenes so if you'd like to see more of the disasters rather than just the pretty stuff let me know but also if you have a small business i understand like now i actually get it we did so much work on that i'm so tired um i got banana blossom for lunch which is usually the reg for me now and then i we just had lunch and then i just left off a lot after lunch because it's 205 now so i'm gonna drive home i'm gonna get into my jimmy jams and i'm gonna keep working i just want to do like the afternoon from home because i don't really feel the best like i just feel a bit run down Yeah, it's really good. How's 
Good morning, girlies. It is 7.27. I am just headed to the beach now because I'm going to meet my girlies and go on a walk. So I'm just around the corner. We're meeting at 7.30, so I'm perfectly on time. Um, and we're just going to go get a walk, get a coffee, maybe get an acai bowl. Um, and yeah, that's the plan. Just a little morning walk. I'm doing a lot of these, which is not something I would usually like do before. Not for any reason. I just never thought to do them but now i've been doing them at least three times a week with all like different groups of like different friends you know so it's nice but yes plan for today is go on a little walk and then i need to leave the walk at like 8 30 which is kind of annoying but it's not really a walk i don't really know why i'm calling it that just at the beach i need to leave the beach at 8 30 because i then need to race home and get ready and then so race home get ready um Go into the office. I have a meeting at 10 with our um, designer. She like draws up all this, like she puts my ideas to paper. I have a meeting with her about a upcoming collection. Well, upcoming, it's gonna be out in the end of the year, but we have to start designing it now. I have a meeting with her um, and then also to like just tweak some products that aren't coming to life, like the sampling that they're, they're arriving and they're just not, the fit isn't giving. So I need to talk to her about them and fix, the measurements of them and then i'm gonna go straight from there and go have a little bit of a shopping day i need to do some shopping for a very exciting trip coming up which i'm sure i can tell you but i just don't want to yet because i just want to like hype it up a little bit and get you guys excited but it's coming up at the start of april i'm very excited but um i need to go shopping for that because it's a very cool place i need like statement pieces um and like cold items you know so i need to go shopping for that and then also i'm gonna go to the camilla and mark warehouse they're having like a warehouse from the 14th to the 17th and today's the 13th and they're letting like friends family influencers in today so i'm gonna go in today they've very kindly given me a voucher so i'm gonna go in and see what they have and let you guys know on my instagram to go in and see what's there oh no i was shooting <laughs> 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 Okay, I'm home. I am in a rush. I'm supposed to be at the office in 15 minutes and I am not even ready. So I'm behind schedule. I'm just going to quickly chuck the lightest makeup on. Um, I don't know why. I just, I think I've left the walk a bit late and then there was traffic because I forgot about school traffic because 8.45 is like prime time for school traffic. So I did not take that into consideration but i'm just gonna do the lightest makeup i am not like gonna be late in the office because my meeting isn't until 10 but i'm not gonna get in i wanted to get in earlier than that because i have other work to do so now i'm just gonna have to go in just for the meeting but that is okay i am loving not wearing foundation recently i've just been using cream products so i'll just go in with cream bronzer like so around the face and then I will take my favorite blush I swear I've had this for a year and it's nowhere near running out like I feel like it's brand new so that's good and then I'll blend that out blends out in three seconds and then I'm literally just so rough with it and then slay and then I will just do my brows a little bit of setting spray my favorite highlighter at the moment from benefit and mascara and that's pretty much all i do on the daily okay done now we're ready to go in to the office that took me what i've been filming for three minutes okay i'm just wearing a super chill outfit just white top and brown pants which is right for me i probably will change into jeans but well, then so now yeah. he's the kicker Especially in touch with last night for ages. But the media stuff, that's fine. But going forward, they don't want to kind of do like an Instagram story and just like we. Oh, so like I just don't think that's an issue. I'm so scared. No, that's fine. Okay. Like they're they're just like can we? Um,
a little note in their order to be like, hey, Not five per state. Like, Lama, you just missed out. Do you think we should do three? So it's like gold, silver, bronze? Or not? <laughs> will you be needing no. your laptop at all? No. Can April take it? Yeah. Or if not, April, you oh, can take the warehouse. My, my own laptop. Take, you take this one. And then just remove it from the cream and the red. The problem is when so you, you have the option. The bow, the Okay, I'm here. That took me forever to get here and find a park, but I'm here. So, cue the shopping montage, I guess. I don't really know where I am, but I'm going to the Camilla Mark warehouse. I'm not sure if I said. I'm going there and then Dion Lee. So, the warehouse is until 1, and I think it's like 12, 10 right now. So, I'm just going to walk around, maybe get some sushi. I just bought Fred again tickets. Why is it every time that I'm vlogging, I go to Fred again? Basically, paint the pig shop. Neck crack. I was in Ben Roy, I was checking out, and it was like Fred again posted a story because I had story notifications on because he always puts up random last minute shows. And he's in Sydney, so I was like, okay, put post notifications on. He was like, Fred again uploaded a story, and I was like, okay, I'm just gonna click on it. Didn't even say what it was, I just saw a link. My visual line's really hurting, it's like catching onto my gum. I need to put like lip balm on. I just saw a link and I clicked on it. I didn't read any of the text. I just clicked on it because if he posts a link, it's going to be to a show. So I clicked on it and it took me to Ticket Tech and I was like, all right, it's it's fucking happening. Like, let's go. So um, I didn't even know what date it was, but I waited in the queue and I was like, I'm not going to get through because I think when I clicked on it, it was 2.11 and I was like, fuck, he probably posted it. And, oh, yeah, it was 2.11. And then when I was on the website and it was like, you know, the waiting page for Ticket Tech, it was like, these tickets went live at 2. And I was like, oh, 11 minutes. Like, they'll be all gone. Because you need to be in, like, within the first minute to get through. Got through. And I was like, oh, my God, I don't even know when this is for. But I'll make sure I'm free. Got through. Added four in my car. And then it told me the date. And I was like, okay, 16th. Went on. And I, I don't even know what date it is right now. I was like, 16th. Okay, went and check my car. It's this Saturday. And I was like, yep, I'm free. Slay. So then I went back, checked out, bought four because the max is four. And I was like, I don't know who's coming with me at this point. I'm just going to get four because worst case, I could just sell two or three or whatever. Obviously two because I'm kind of gold bone. But I could sell one or two. So I just got four, which is the max, checked out. And it was like, um, sign into Ticket Tech. I have a Ticket Tech account because I literally have the app on my phone. Like I have Ticket Tech. Trust, the one time I actually get through on tickets, it's like sign into your Ticket Tech account. Signed in, wrong password. I was like, what do you mean? I do not have time for this. So I was like, I don't have time to be like reset password, blah, blah, blah. So I just pressed signed up and I just made a whole new account with my management email. Like my, my email that me and my manager both have access to. I was like, I don't give a fuck. I'm just going to put that in. Made an account. I needed like my address, my postcode, my middle name, my last name, my everything. And I was like, oh my God, I don't have time for this. I was like, it's so just going to like sell out by the time I get to my card or it's going to kick me out. Because you know, you have, you have like a few minutes to check it out. I was standing on the side of the road. I was like, if anyone comes up to me right now, like, because usually when I'm shopping like the city, a few people will come up and ask for photos because I feel like the city, there's just heaps of people in the city. I was like, if anyone comes and asks for a photo right now, I'm going to be like, give me two secs because like, I am so stressed. So I was standing there typing it all in, checked out. It was like, do not refresh browser. And I was standing there like, oh my God, fucking got them. Four tickets, right? My friend, Caitlin, has been dying to go because the first time I went, I took April and I bought those tickets secondhand. Secondhand, I bought those tickets 
off someone reselling them so they were half they were double the price so i actually got these for like 130 each it was like 500 it was 500 for five or 500 and something for, for four sorry and the first time i got them i surprised my friend april with them because she like wanted to go so bad and then after we went my other friend caitlin was like i'm so jealous and like every ever ever since that show she's been tagging me in all these giveaways like everything she's like i'm going to fred again like with you like we need to get tickets so i was like oh my god i'm gonna surprise caitlin with them so i texted in our group chat and i was like oh like did you see like fred again uploaded a show trying to suss it and she was like yeah oh my god i saw that like i didn't try and get them because like i can't go and i was like what do you mean and she was like oh i'm at pink she's obsessed with pink so this motherfucker is at pink and i was like bro i literally said in the chat i was like well jokes i actually got them i just want to surprise you but you can't even fucking go so i'm gonna take my brother-in-law because he loves a little bit of a boogie he's so much fun i love going to festivals with him he's just like the best so i was like okay i'm gonna take him and then my sister obviously as well she is the biggest homebody like she if she never traveled if she never left like our area ever again it wouldn't bother her like she doesn't go out she doesn't do any of that like she she, has, she doesn't go out i always forget she's like 22 because i think she's like 40 in my brain because she just doesn't go out she's been out probably three times in her life but she said she'll go if he goes and i called him and he was like are you serious and i was like yeah and he was like yes i'll fucking go so <coughs> siblings on tour Oh, they're a bit small. They fit me, right? Yeah. Well, they're a bit skinny jeans. I don't know if that's supposed to be. I feel like they need to be bigger. Yeah, me too. But I love that shirt on you. Do you? Yeah. You look hot in that shirt. Well, then I'm taking back. Keep, keep the shirt. Yeah, I'll take the pants back. But keep the shirt. Yeah. That shirt's doing things to me. What's that? Wow! <laughs> do you like it? Yes, that is hot. Do you? Or do you feel like you're in pajamas? I feel like I'm in pajamas. Right. I understand why you would say that. But to the trained eye, you look a million bucks. What other pants can I wear? What? Show me a white jean. Right. Wow. Do you like it? Yeah. But if you don't like it, what would you wear? A blue jean? Glasses at the moment? Or yeah. yeah. So yep. It's just a slight prescription. Yep. But if you want to try those on. What do you think of those? Yep. How's your vision feel sort of having a little look around with those on? Do you feel like... Yeah, a lot better. It just sharpens it up a yeah. bit, yeah? And then the fitting of them, like they're sitting nice and level. Do you feel you'd want them any tighter than that? Or do you feel like they're holding okay? No, I think they're perfect. Let's be compared to those. If you kind of like to wear them a bit lower down, mm. say it's just finding that right place and that you're comfortable. How's that feel as well? They're a little bit looser. Do you want me to tighten those a bit? Or do you want to see... Maybe a little bit. Hey girlies, how are we? So I woke up, I went to do something with my nephew, and then I just went and picked up my glasses from Specsavers, and now we are going to a family lunch at the pub, because it's, we have a birthday today, so we're going to that. So I won't be vlogging, because I'll be with the family. Okay. First pair. Close your eyes. Open. Nice. Do you like them? Yeah. Just a classic clear. I've had. The, I have these. I have these somewhere that I just don't know where they are. Beautiful. Now this next pair is a bit out of my comfort zone. Okay. But I, I really like comfort. them. I really like them. I've never had anything like this. Okay, wait, don't open. 
Alright, Penny. Wow. Okay. What are your thoughts? I love, I love it. Hi Queens, I'm on the way to have a little walk. So it is 4 p.m. I thought I don't want to just sit at home, I want to kind of go out. Bay is at golf, so I was like, I just want to go and have a nice little walk. Like usually I'll just chill at home and just like edit and do work, but I was like, I'm gonna go on a little walk. So I'm gonna go on a walk. It's fucking hot today. Like lunch was so hot. I ended up not leaving early, but like we didn't stay that long because it was so hot like my it was like the type of hot where like my thighs were sticking to the chair at the rest at the pub but it was good it was so much fun um and then literally just went home unboxed some packages because some packages came um and then i decided to go on a walk so it's really hot i'm probably not it's not going to be an actual walk because it's hot Good morning guys, it's a Friday morning, it's 9am, um, I'm just checking in, probably won't be vlogging at all again today, but I just want to let you know that I'm just having a day with my partner, I'm taking him to the dentist now, and then I'll be looking after him today. So, that's just my little check in, and I'll probably speak to you tomorrow, for Fred. Who did I Looks like you stop highlights because I don't get it. <laughs> it's virgin hair. Because I'm not a fake bitch. <laughs> no, I really like. I would be. Like, just... No, I love it. Huh? It's like the Haley Bieber color. Oh my god! You know what I want to get? Sorry, I know. I know. I just said it's hard. So... <laughs> you. But have you seen the styling brush, everyone? The infrared. Oh, I feel like that really damages your hair. Hey girls, I'm just leaving the office. I went in at about 10.30, did a bit of work and then had lunch with the girls. I don't really have too much to do in there today. I did a little bit of work and then now I'm on the way home. It is 12.52. Um, I was gonna get my nails fixed, but the appointment got taken. I didn't reply quick enough. So I will probably just go home and chill. Good morning, my sweet little angels. So it is 9.18. I got up at about 9 and I've just been running around like a mad woman trying to plan my outfit for Fred. So I think we narrowed it down. I'm just going to wear these cool like low-waisted dark denim jeans and then a top. Like just make it really comfy and casual. Add a little extra tear, extra tear, extra layer of tan last night. So I'm feeling nice and glowy and fresh for Fred. But I'm actually just about to head out and go get a coffee with the fam. So I'm just gonna chuck a little bit of makeup on just to literally match my face to my neck. But yeah, so I'm glad that I've sorted out my outfit. I don't have to go to the shops because um, I've got everything here, which is great. Um, I'm also clearing out my wardrobe. Like every time I'm looking through for something, for an outfit, I'm like, taking out stuff that I don't wear and I'm putting it in a pile and I'll obviously go to Hunter Markets. Yeah, so I'm going to have a good amount to give to them soon. Um, I also, I'm loving this eye cream. I've been using it for like, honestly, a while now. I want to say like six months, maybe. Not like every single day, but just like every now and then. It's just like an under eye banana cream. I just love the way it makes me feel. Like it just makes my under eyes feel so fresh. I Anyway, I'm tangenting because I'm really bored and want to talk. But, um, yeah, so f today I'm going to go to coffee with the fam. And then I'm getting my nails fixed at two. My nail lady is a legend and she's just quickly fitting me in to get the three fixed. So, one, two, three. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to jump in at two, quickly get them fixed. Because then I go away again on... Monday. So today is Saturday. I'm going to get two to get them fixed. And then I'll come home. I'll chill for a bit. I'll then get ready for Fred. And then I'm driving everyone down. So I've got a full car. It said when you bought the tickets, like Royal Botanical Gardens, 6 p.m., right? And then the info went out last night and it says that Fred won't be on until 8.30, I think. 8.30, maybe 9. So, which I should have expected that, but I was just mentally prepared for him to come out at 6 because that's what it said on the ticket. But obviously that just meant like doors open. 
So there's a few other DJs on from six onwards. There's a few other DJs on, and then he comes out at 8.30. Hello. Um, but yeah, so I'm excited for that. I'm going with my sister and her partner, and then two of my friends. And I'm just going to get my nails fixed, as I mentioned before. Oh my god, I was like, where's the phone? Girl, you gotta jump upstairs, the lighting is it's like so clear. We just had to stop and do a little pee on the way. Yeah, so we're back on route and we're about half an hour away. So Fred, we're coming. It looks like it's gonna rain, but hopefully it doesn't. Oh my god. You gotta stay. <laughs> <laughs> I've got the biggest one. <laughs> end of the vlog thank you for watching it was quite a long rambly one but i hope you enjoyed fred again is doing another show tonight and he keeps texting on whatsapp weirdo <laughs> what <laughs> um thank you for watching this is the current state of me and i'll probably be like this all day love